So hello everyone. Today I have got Biswadeep Das with me, and Biswadeep uh, is a student of Triple IIT Bangalore. Uh, recently, he will be joining uh, Media dot net as an SRE. So today he will be uh, sharing his experiences regarding his master's degree at Triple IIT Bangalore. So Biswadeep, uh, I am heading off to you. Please introduce yourself. Hello everyone. Uh, there is nothing much left to introduce about me, as Mustafa Zir has already given my introduction. I am a student of Triple IIT Bangalore. I'm doing my master's there, and currently I'm doing I'm doing an internship at Media dot net. And this July, my master's will be over, and then I'll join as a full time joiner at at Media dot net. Okay, that's very much great to know. And uh, I would like to know, Biswadeep, that what made you decide uh, for a master's at Triple IIT Bangalore? Uh, so first, let's go with what made me go for masters. Uh, like after B Tech, we all still have that ambition and thought that once in life we want to go to IITs and into the big colleges. All right. So that's why and masters not only just for masters. See, uh, for if you go with gate, gate is mostly it's all about the basic subjects and everything. So when you are preparing for gate, it also prepares you for placements anyway. So the basic subjects like DBMS, networking, data structures. And uh, operating systems and others. So that was the thought. Ki chalo, ek tir me do nishane. Theek hai, placements ka bhi ho jayega, and will be also done with gate. So that's why. And why Triple IIT Bangalore? Uh, so since I belong to the general category, obviously the first thought is go to the IITs. But I could not make it to the IITs, and Triple IIT Bangalore has a, is a really good college. So that's why I chose Triple IIT Bangalore. Okay, great. So, uh, would you like to share how much was your score in GATE and uh, what was the cutoff during your year uh, for Triple IIT Bangalore? Uh, cutoff. My score was two seven twenty three, and rank I don't remember. But the uh, the score, least cutoff I think it was six hundred something. I don't exactly remember the numbers. It's quite a big score. Whatever you achieved that time, <laughs> that I feel yeah. And uh, so, how did you prepare for the exam GATE? Uh, for preparing for gate, uh, obviously, like I took, uh, if you know, uh, Professor uh, Ravindra Babu Ravula, I took his course, so I prepared through his course only, and and for the test series, I think I got a made easy test series. Okay, so you were regular with the test series, and you were constantly preparing with RBR course. Uh, uh -huh. Quite a bit famous course for GATE uh, for our engineering it, students. Yeah, right. Uh, it was, but then again, uh, if you know later, he merged with an academy, and uh, that course is not there anymore. Okay, great. And so let's move on. That uh, once you get in Triple IIT Bangalore, and uh, how is the life, and how is the college campus, what facilities you people get? Uh, I would like to know that. Okay, so talking about the college campus, the first thing is there. People should know the college campus compared to the IITs is not that big, obviously, but it's very like well structured and it's like full of greenery. And other than that, we have a badminton court. Not 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 one. How many we have? Two badminton courts and three actually. Three badminton courts. One uh, basketball court we have. One football ground we have. And there are TT tables, foosball tables. And other uh, like chess and other things. Okay, great. Uh, oh, see, we also have a gym. I forgot to mention gym, and we also have like uh, one of our like uh, the coach who is there, Girish sir. He also trains for the gym, and he also teaches boxing there. We also have boxing there, boxing classes. Great, great. So, so if someone wishes to learn boxing, he can go there and. Yeah, boxing is there. I, uh, basketball coach is also there. Tennis, ha, uh, tennis ground is also there. Sorry, I forgot to mention the okay, basketball great. and tennis grounds are side by side. So what I know is that Triple IIT Bangalore is in the heart of the main city. Electronic city is the place. What I feel. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I would like to know, Biswadeep, about uh, can you describe our day inside Triple IIT Bangalore in terms of your master's course? Okay, so that completely depends upon like the the subjects and how much load you have, right? So, for example, so talking about let's say choosing subjects. So generally, in for masters, since we also have to prepare for placements, we like balance our courses. We take a few heavy courses and light courses. Heavy courses for so that we have good projects and everything for the CV, and light courses just to maintain the CGPA, good CGPA as well. 
so let's say uh, if i talk about my day let's say i uh, and uh, you have the course schedule and when and uh, in which class the classes will be uh, held all right so let's say uh, for in my case a few days let's say tuesday and thursday used to be packed i had like back to back classes and let's say i have two classes on saturday and monday and wednesday used to be free so that completely depends upon the type of courses uh, you choose and uh, the the duration of the courses ki kaun si day mein hai and kab so that's how you manage it but yeah also you have to make sure just that two classes don't clash otherwise you'll get stuck with the attendance and then all that great so you have the flexibility to uh, choose your courses uh, inside the master's degree yes 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 it's totally up to you just have to finish like six uh, there are like uh, we have uh, course numbers right so there is few six you have to finish six uh, cs prefix courses and other than that if you finish five courses having a same prefix for example let's say aiml you get a specialization in aiml or networking yeah so i have also known thing. that uh, inside triple it bangalore you have the provision of uh, there are certain areas where you can get the specialization uh what you choose and uh, how the specializations look like specializations for example i, I didn't i did not have any specializations because uh, and so if i talk about the specializations we have aiml specialization there is vlss specialization for the ecs students we also have uh, tscs which is theoretical computer science and i think networking is also the computer network cn is there i do not have a specialization because initially i started off thinking about i'll do in aiml but later on i realized that the maths required for aiml is too heavy okay and i wanted to time find for coding and everything so then uh, i managed my courses with cs courses uh, so i have one full stack course and uh, one devops course and i took few courses uh, like we have oh we also have cyber security specialization i think cs uh, csy so and uh, i took the cyber security course so i managed the heavy and light courses there great to know this and uh, it's not mandatory to have a specialization there okay so yeah now i would like to ask you that uh, what are the placement opportunities from triple itb okay placement okay uh, that's the question everyone i guess wants to hear so placements opportunities are pretty good uh, we uh, you can also like go to the website of the college and you can, you can check the uh, average or median placement highest packages and everything people who are interested in the numbers but yeah i can say you have plenty of opportunity for placements there okay we have uh, sd profile we have uh, companies come for uh, data science profile and even like uh, we have another uh, course which is the uh, digital society course so for that they have product management profiles i guess associate profiles so all these are there so uh, placement opportunity is pretty good all right or most of the product based companies is our colleges but people who are still interested in the numbers only you can go to the triple itv website and you can check it there okay considering your batch of mtech uh, what's the maximum ctc anyone has got maximum ctc uh, it, it's i think 50 50 lpa hmm and who offered that uh, abd ab dynamics which is a sister company of cisco okay great great and uh, so that's a great thing and uh, now what's the percentage of people that have got placed from mtech percentage it would be like more than 80 to 90 i think it's around 90 few people are left because it took a hit due to recession this year but the placements are still going on companies are still visiting okay that's really nice to know that still inside triple it bangalore uh, companies are visiting and uh, i would like to know that uh, what are the research opportunities uh, that you people get residing inside the college okay for research uh, like if you talk about mtech so uh, being honest whether it doesn't matter whether you go to triple itb or I, or iits so the thing is that uh, for me the way i say it, that mtech is all about like it's we generally say the mtech is about 2 years but for me i would say it's about only 1 year because after one year you have your placements and everything right so after my placements in the third semester uh, uh, we have something called as rep which is research elective and project elective so there you get to chance you get a chance to work with a professor and 
with a phd student as well so i had a, a project collective so uh, under a professor i mean basically under a professor a phd student was working uh, about sensors right about the heat sensors that we have in our laptops and computers and everything so i got a chance to work with him i did a part of his work all right on the linux so writing the code and everything so i got it so that's how you get the exposure to work with the professors or with the phd students and get to see closely what our, what the research is all about okay and other than that we have phd uh, we have phd uh, phds and ms courses there as well great great and i also know that triple it bangalore uh, offers you a provision to have an entire semester uh, into internship uh yes okay. yes yes so which is the fourth semester so it is up to you either you can go for the internship or you can also do thesis so it is up to you i opted for internship okay and i think media.net has offered you that right that internship yeah, yes okay and uh, so i would like to ask so, you like that. how these uh, internship profiles are offered is basically the companies which visit the college they uh, give you offers in three types which is either internship and internship plus full time or only full time so all these profiles are available in my case it is internship plus full time some companies only offer internship and later on they give you the ppo and some companies only offer the full times like the way we have in iits and other colleges okay very much nice to know this and uh, so what was uh, how did your interview went for media.net that what i would uh, that i would like to ask Uh, okay so for the interview process first uh, we had a uh, online quiz kind of a thing all right so we it had mostly basic questions from gate about cn os dbms and uh, what i had to do i had to write a i had to write a small script linux script bash script so that was it so after the qa next day again there was another written test which was on socket programming so say they basically gave us the requirements yeah uh, all right and uh, and uh, just to let you know internet was allowed they said you can use the internet all right but we need a good code like readability and everything and you should know what you are doing so in my case uh, i the, uh, you can do it in python and other languages in my case i did it in c because in the previous company in which i worked i had it was an embedded company so that's why i wrote the code in c and during the uh, coding test only in this second coding test only uh, of socket programming they will go through your code they will ask you questions in between so after that so when that was done so the next uh, round was about uh, testing your cs fundamentals again and the projects you did and everything so that was round 3 round 4 was about uh, high level design and high level design so they asked me like how would you uh, design instagram let's say but uh, the interview uh, with me he was like very helpful he was very helpful and supportive he kept dropping me hints so and the fifth round was about the hr round so that's it okay so this is quite a bit of uh, difference that you have said right now uh, as per my experience uh, okay. i would like to ask that uh, whatever you have uh, done while your placements uh, were they a part of your college curriculum you have already gone through these things as a part of your uh, studies right so talking about coding obviously yes, since it's a masters course they won't uh, have specific classes for coding it's, it depends on your peer group and you how you manage time for that all right so basically you have to manage time between your subjects so and uh, uh, find time for coding so it depends mostly people do that striver sheet okay take you forward we all know that so other than that uh, high level design uh we have a few courses right now in high level design and microservices and devops is there so all these things really help great great and the socket programming and all what you did uh have you uh, gone through socket the- programming also in the first semester uh, although so- i knew about socket programming since i worked in that uh, embedded company for a year but also there is a course on linux all right in the first semester we call it software systems so there they te- teach you about socket programming file descriptors and uh, let's say the uh, linux system and uh, what else the file systems in linux and everything so great great so this is really nice to know uh, that how the entire uh, interview process went on so yeah and uh, at the end just another question i'm left with 
any day or any moment that's quite memorable to you at triple it bangalore see uh, it's uh, not the college it's the friends that make it memorable theek hai so even if you today go back to your btech college you won't find it the same way but you have your friends with them so yeah i'm right now i'm in my home right now i will be going to college on 10th july so that i can spend a few more days with my friends so with friends every day is special there so it's the hostel memories that stays with you and obviously there is no restriction obviously all right you can roam in the campus at 2 am 3 am 2 am is nothing it's like just like evening there all right canteen canteen sab khula hai to kuch describe karna chahoge ek din jis din bada maza aaya matlab ki kabhi bhul nahi sakte us din ko jis din placements hote hain let's say uh, kisi ka placement hua theek hai raat ko let's say सुबह एग्जाम्स वगैरह दिए रात को रिजल्ट आया सब कैंटीन चलते हैं कि हाँ आज मेरी ट्रीट है वो एक मतलब वैसे रफ ट्रीट होती है उसके अलग से ट्रीट तो है ही ठीक है कि होटल में जाके वो सब रेस्टोरेंट में जाके वो सब तो है ही ये सब रात को बैडमिंटन खेलना या फिर और क्या है बैडमिंटन खेलना हो गया या फिर रात को खाना मंगाना हो गया दो बजे तीन बजे ये कुछ मंगा लो ये सब कभी कभी रात को गेड़ी मारने निकल गए इधर उधर तो वो तो है ही नाइस nice, नाइस nice. और कभी लगा कि एकेडमिक्स का प्रेशर बहुत ज्यादा है भाई मेरे लिए तो करना बहुत मुश्किल है नहीं वैसा तो नहीं लगा बट हाँ मतलब थोड़ा प्रेशर तो लेना पड़ेगा क्योंकि इफ यू वांट टू गेट प्लेस एज अर्ली एज पॉसिबल क्योंकि फिर अगर ऐसा बोलना नहीं चाहिए बट लेट्स से फिर कंपनी जाने लगती है लोग प्लेस होने लगते हैं यू सी दीपल अराउंड यू आर गेटिंग प्लेस एंड यू आर नॉट ठीक है तो थोड़ा तो लेना पड़ेगा बस वो दो ही दो ही सेमेस्टर है एक बार प्लेसमेंट हो जाए उसके बाद टाइम कैसे निकलता है पता ही नहीं चलता तो देखते देखते कॉन्वोकेशन आ जाता है एंड कॉलेज लाइफ का बहुत सही अब कब है आप लोगों का कॉन्वोकेशन हमारा कॉन्वोकेशन है 2 जुलाई को मतलब एक ही महीना बाकी है बस हां एक ही महीना बाकी है 10 तारीख को मैं जा रहा हूं 10 जून को मैं जा रहा हूं तीन चार हफ्ते रहूंगा बस उसके बाद फिर कॉलेज खत्म थोड़ा बहुत रोना धोना और उसके बाद फिर अपने आप को रखना और रिजल्ट्स वगैरह आपके आ गए लास्ट सेम के वैसे आप तो इंटर्नशिप में ऑप्ट किए हैं हाँ हाँ हमारा ओ सीजीपी अगर किसी को जानो द वे और ट्रिपल एडी बैंगलो ऑफिस सीजीपी इट्स आउट ऑफ फोर आई थिंक बाहर के इंस्टीट्यूट्स में भी ऐसा ही होता है सो इट्स आउट ऑफ फोर सीजीपी ऑफर करता है माइनस थ्री आउट ऑफ फोर एंड फॉर प्लेसमेंट एंड एवरी यू नीड आई थिंक टू पॉइंट एट टू पॉइंट एट इज द कट ऑफ Slash 2.8 out of four is the cutoff for placements. Mostly companies who come here they prefer that 2.8 out of four. Okay, nice. Actually, this is a little thrill moment. It is that companies are coming, the placements are going well, and all. Ah, uh, this time it took a hit because of the recession and everything. A little bit. Otherwise, the our previous batch, the seniors, they got placed really well. Nice, nice, nice. And what are your future goals from now? फ्यूचर गोल्स तो यही है कि मैं इस प्रोफाइल में कंटिन्यू करूं एंड लाइक एज वी हैव सीन इन दिस सिनेरियो कि जब रिसेशन आता है जब लोग फायर होते हैं इट डजेंट डिपेंड अपॉन कि आप कितने अच्छे एम्प्लॉय हो इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन जिस प्रोडक्ट प्रोडक्ट पे आप काम कर रहे हो या प्रोजेक्ट पे काम कर रहे हो वेदर दैट इज मेकिंग प्रॉफिट और नॉट सो ऑब्वियसली आई वुड लाइक टू स्टिक टू अ प्रोजेक्ट और प्रोडक्ट व्हिच इज प्रॉफिट मेकिंग और आई वुड लाइक टू बिकम अ प्रोडक्ट मैनेजर एज सुन एज पॉसिबल एंड मेक श्योर कि प्रोडक्ट प्रॉफिटेबल है या नहीं वो मेरे हाथ में उससे फायदा नहीं है तुम कितना रिवाइज करते हो उससे फर्क पड़ता है सो so, तो वही है की थोड़ा रिविजन टाइम टू टाइम करते दो से तीन बार तो कम से कम सिलेबस रिवाइज करना ही पड़ेगा एंड प्रीवियस योर क्वेश्चन एंड कोई एक टेस्ट सीरीज बस अच्छा एक बात जो नॉर्मली लोग कहते हैं कि मास्टर्स करके क्या फायदा आप छह महीना प्लेसमेंट प्रिपरेशन कर लो आपको बिग कंपनीज मिल जाएगी या फिर आपका प्लेसमेंट हो जाएगा सो एंड सो इस बात आपको क्या लगता है कितनी सच्चाई है क्या वाकई में मास्टर्स डिग्री करके कोई फायदा नहीं है फायदा तो है फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इट ओपन अब जैसे थोड़ा बहुत मेरे को पी का एक्सपोजर मिला क्योंकि वो पी मैंने सर के अंडर किया जो पी स्टूडेंट थे उनके अंडर पहली बात तो ये दूसरी बात यू गेट टू लिव योर स्टूडेंट लाइफ फॉर टू मोर ईयर्स ठीक है तीसरी बात ये है कि मास्टर्स का जैसे अभी देर आर प्रोफाइल्स विच प्रेफर और अगर आपको जो प्रेफर करते हैं मास्टर स्टूडेंट्स और फॉर एग्जांपल लेट्स से अगर आपको वो चेंज करना है आपका डोमेन चेंज करना है आपको एआईएमएल में आना है सो मास्टर्स इज द थिंग आई वुड से क्योंकि 
बींग ऑनेस्ट हम लोगों ने कोर्सेस वगैरह देखे हैं कि ए आई एम एल के कोर्सेस वगैरह है बट अंटिल एनलेस आप समझ रहे हो कि वो चीज जो पाइथन में तो हमने कर दिया चलो लगा के रिग्रेशन वगैरह बट वो कैसे हो रहा है एंड एवरीथिंग तो उसके लिए मास्टर्स का टाइम थोड़ा सा चाहिए अपने को या व्हाट आई नो एक पोजीशन है ऐसा दैट्स क्वाइट न्यू व्हाट आई कॉल देम एज द अप्लाइड साइंटिस्ट पोजीशन सो दैट रिक्वायर्स एट लीस्ट अ मास्टर्स और अ पीएचडी बेसिकली या तो और एक्चुअली इन इन पोजीशंस को आप लोग के कॉलेजेस से ज्यादा एक्सेस है स्टूडेंट्स को बिकॉज़ कंपनीज में विजिट फॉर हायरिंग सच पोजीशंस व्हाट लोकल टायर थ्री कॉलेजेस डोंट गेट दैट राइट दिस इज अ क्वाइट राइट राइट बिकॉज़ वी ऑल हैव डन आवर बैचलर्स फ्रॉम tier three colleges we are you were from iim i was from macau in house so we hmm. never got such opportunities that's the thing tier three mein actually kya hai jo baat hoti hai ki 6 mahina placement ka preparation karo aur aage badh jao uske liye aapko chahiye referral to aapka network bhi utna acha nahi banta tier three se aap ek bar top tier mein pahunch jate ho koi kisko janta hai koi kisko janta hai wahan se kuch na kuch nikal jayega true true uh, including uh, apne seniors bhi agar zyada uh, well uh, known companies mein placed nahi hai to referral milne ka chances aur kam jata hai हाँ 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 दूसरी बात ये कि सच बताओ तो कोई आपको उतना भाव ही नहीं देता कि यार अच्छा ठीक है ये तो टीएल थ्री कॉलेज से तो थ्रू ये लिंक्डइन प्रोफाइल देने क्या जाने दो आई एम नॉट सेइंग मिलता नहीं है बट लाइक बहुत मतलब यहाँ आपके प्रोबेबल चांसेस बहुत बढ़ जाते हैं एंड एट द एंड ऑफ द डे लाइक द पीपल हु आर वॉचिंग इट दे नो की पहली बात प्लेसमेंट वगैरह में थोड़ा सा या फिर रेफरेंस वगैरह में थोड़ा सा लग काम करता है सो एट द एंड ऑफ द डे इट्स अ गेम ऑफ नंबर्स इतने ज्यादा होंगे आपके पास कन्वर्ट करने के चांसेस ज्यादा ओके अनदर थिंग आप लोगों के कॉलेजेस में ऐसा है कुछ कि uh, एक बार अगर कोई किसी कंपनी में प्लेस्ड हो गया दूसरे वाले में नहीं बैठ सकता हां जी हां ये ये रूल है दैट रूल इज देयर बहुत सारे कॉलेजेस में होता है इंक्लूडिंग टायर 3 में भी कि आपका एक बार प्लेसमेंट हो गया दूसरे में नहीं यहां पे वैसा है कि अगर जो मिल रहा है आई थिंक देयर इज सर्टेन नंबर की लेट्स से आपको 10 का मिला है तो 15 या 20 के ऊपर का आएगा तो वापस बैठने देंगे मैं एग्जांपल दे रहा हूं बट जनरली ऐसा आता है कि सीटीसी 18 है 20 है 25 है तो उसके ऊपर 50 वाला कौन ही देता तो एप डायनेमिक्स जैसे एक कंपनी बताई तो मोस्टली वैसा है ठीक है ऑफ कैंपस आप ट्राई कर सकते हो ऑफ कैंपस आप जा सकते हो सो क्वाइट अ बिट बहुत सारी बातें आपके साथ हुई विश्वदीप एंड बहुत अच्छा लगा बात मिली बहुत अच्छा लगा तो व्हाट्सएप पे बात होती है हां So let's uh, have a very good convocation at your end. Uh, thank you, thank you so much. Very, very much congratulations for cracking media dot net. Thank uh, you, thank you, bye. Yeah, hope you become product manager as soon as possible. <laughs> Thanks to everyone who are watching. Ah, आप लोग में से भी कोई अपने colleges के experience share करना चाहते हो, most welcome. We'll have a talk for sure. And uh, if you liked it, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks to all of you. Thank you, thank bye. you.